Good morning YouTube. So it's Saturday again and we're back working on the van. Uh, as you can see, it's quite cold today. Uh, obviously this morning when we got up. So I'll just show you what jobs we're gonna do this weekend. Well, try and get done this weekend. That's the first job. There's a hole, um, there's a hole just there and there's had a, it's already had a patch put in there but it's not very good. I did think it was just that hole there and then I just noticed that someone's put that patch there when I took the took the mat off. So that's a, that's a job for today and then once that's done, pretty much the front end is all ready um, and all been welding up back, back for paint. Just show you what else I'm going to try and um, get done this weekend. This will be an inside job but we'll... Uh, so I'll just... Instead of trying to get the original dash lights working uh, I've priced I've priced it what I need it's gonna cost a fair fair amount of money I've just bought some um, blue LED well they are dash lights but and but just universal fit so I'm gonna try and fit those this weekend so I can see the clocks when I'm driving at night and um, I maybe just put a just a switch somewhere where I can turn them on and off something simple like that for now because that's not gonna stop it driving Maybe in years to come, when I've got some spare cash, I'll uh, think about buying a new da uh, new clock and whatever I need for it uh, to put it back to original. But for the time being, it's, I think it'll be a, a fairly simple fix. I'm going to try and do that this weekend. But I can do that inside most of the wiring and that, and then get ready to fit. Let's so say that sill was done the other day. There was a hole there, but it's pretty much the front end. Then is is pretty much done. Um, just needs a bit of tidying up here and there and then that can be done and then then all that's left to do with the welding plenty of body work left to do but all that to do left to do the welding is my rear quarter you can see from other videos i have um i have got the both panels for that but i'll be quite honest with you i just haven't been brave enough to at the minute just to cut it off um, Last time I did welding was when I was at college and I was learning body repair so many many years ago so I just wanted to do some other bits and bobs or a little bits of welding just to to practice on really but I'm going to have to bite the bullet with that pretty much probably next weekend uh, start getting the quarter off at least and see what I've got to do so stay tuned for that one that'll be interesting quite a big job coming up there. So quite a uh, Cut the section out of the floor. Um, just going to tidy up now, ready to um, to clean it all up, and then we start making a patch. made a patch out of um, some cardboard and all we're doing now we've got the, pat the patch to the shape that we want um, I'm going to um, transfer it round onto a uh, piece of seal and then um, get it welded in there give it another bit of a clean up and then weld it straight back in there so I do apologize I've missed a step I thought my uh, camera was recording but it isn't so I've welded the um, welded the step in um, that's all in I'm just fiberglassing now and I'll just try and uh, make it look a bit pretty that's me done for today Absolutely freezing outside and the lights just about to go So I just threw a bit of primer over the, the repair for now need a little bit more work but it depends how fussy you're gonna be or um, whether I probably decide to put this back um, Drill some holes, obviously drill some holes after where these were again um, But I haven't got the one I haven't got the one for the other side so don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but yeah, just threw some primer on for now. I'm going to wax oil underneath. Possibly a job for tomorrow. It's turned out quite nice. 
Right then guys, I'll see you soon. Good morning again YouTube. As you can see, second day, still repaired yesterday, and typically what I've been getting with this at the minute is it's absolutely dreadful again outside. Good old uh, great British weather. One day of really nice sunshine and the next day it's absolutely pissing it down. So just um so what I've been doing in the house um, and what we're going to have a go at uh, trying to do today, obviously my, I, I mentioned earlier on that the uh, lights didn't work in the dash, so while it's absolutely mulling it down outside, I'm going to have a go at um, trying to do something with the lights and the dash. I'm going to put them on a switch for now, I think I uh, leaked into the, the ashtray, I'm going to put the switch down there somewhere. Um, but yeah, that's all I'm going to be able to show you today, unfortunately. And I think this week's video is going to be um, quite a short one. I hope you enjoyed uh, last week's video. What I've actually done is I ordered... Um, I don't know how good this is going to come up on video. But I've ordered some um, blue LED lights from um, eBay, I think. The old bulbs fitted there in the back. Um but they work off that blue um, circuit board through there that doesn't work so what I'm going to do I'm just going to wire around if you can see in there put a little blue LED and then hopefully I've tried them in the, the kitchen test them in the kitchen then hopefully that's going to be good enough to um, um, illuminate the, the lights and the clocks just see how it goes nothing it's only cost me a couple of pounds to um, to try and have a go if so I'm not going to lose anything if it doesn't work so I'll just see what it looks like in the end bear with me so well I hope you can all see that that's what it will look like once it's all wired in with the um, with the blue LED um, it's not on a switch at the minute <laughs> I'll put it on just a 12 volt battery. Um, I haven't got been able to get round to um, doing it to a switch. I've put the switch in down there, um, but I haven't I haven't figured out the wiring yet. Um, it's absolutely terrible. The weather. I'll just show you outside. The weather is absolutely terrible, and I'm I've got so much to do this weekend. So I'll jump back on it another time. Weather is horrible, dull. So. That's me going to be done for this week again. Just a, sorry for a, a very short video. Um, just haven't really had the time. Um, we've done that. Just bear with me. Repaired that, didn't we? We put a, a patch in. Um, Yesterday, but then today the weather is just terrible just to finish anything off. Um, one of the jobs we are going to do, I bought some ramps and I'm going to um, put her up in the air and have a look all underneath. Um, I know I'm just a su uh, sucker for punishment. I haven't been underneath here yet, so have a look underneath, see what's going under there. I bought some uh, underbody. Um, underbody sealer so I'm going to paint all under there and then hopefully in the week I'm on afternoon so in the morning next week I'm going to um, carry on and see if I can uh, figure out how to get this all wired in but today I'm just going to give it neck right then guys I'll see you soon thank you thanks for watching please uh, don't forget to subscribe uh, hit the like button don't forget to click on the notification button so you don't miss the, the progress of older Polly Gray. Cheers guys, thank you. I couldn't resist myself. I popped back round when it had gone dark. Oh, it's trying to get focused because of the lights. I really like Ooh, I really like that. Looks dead good. Let's give me a bit closer. Yeah, I'm happy with that. 